So my name is Paul Erickson. I graduated MCC in May of 2007. It was a rather winding path. I actually never finished high school. Um, so I dropped out somewhere in my junior year. And it was about six years in between that and actually rejoining MCC. And it was at the, uh, I guess, urgings of one of my good friends that uh, I decided to come down here and see what was possible. But it was something that really had built up in me over the years that I was out of school. Um, just something in the back of my mind that said, you know, eventually you need to go and, you know, sort of prove to yourself that you can, you know, succeed in this academic setting. Well, at MCC, I actually had been working full time and there was a lot of uh, juggling back and forth between, you know, taking the classes here as well as, as working off campus. And I would say to um, the clubs and everything, the activities that I was involved with outside of the classroom, as well as the people that I met through the courses. Um, I've met some you know, people in those very cal classes that went on to Cornell or UT Dallas. Um, but I would say that between the clubs, just sort of balancing everything, and then those people that I met uh, really prepared me for uh, sort of the myriad of challenges that uh, were awaiting me to the next level. So Cornell sort of came knocking on the door. Um, it was actually a letter that I got that I thought was a, a joke from that very friend, um, but it was in fact from the Career and Transfer Center and working with, at the time, Greg Bocchino and uh, Rebecca Mack. Um, they were really instrumental from the September of 2006 until you know, I opened up the letter saying congratulations. I think my uh, father put it succinctly, he said they took a high school dropout and turned him into an Ivy Leaguer. After I got to Cornell, I was sort of instrumental in this MCC to Cornell connection that they had developed. And one of the questions that I got one time was, when did you stop considering yourself as a community college student and start you know, considering yourself a Cornell student? And I don't know that that point has been reached yet, and I don't know that it will be.